right, thanks very much, Lee. Adding fuel to the fire. That's what some believe the nation's top infectious disease doctor is doing as he weighs in on the debate over reopening schools for in-person teaching. Eight on your side's Megan Gannon is live in Pasco County at Landa Lakes High School this morning. Good morning to you, Megan. Hey, good morning, Avery. Yeah, Dr. Anthony Fauci says that if you can reopen schools, then you should do so. But many teachers here in Pasco County and even across the Bay Area, they don't think that's the safest option. We're really pushing to work with district to say, hey, this is not safe. There's no way to make it safe. Um, and so we got to go. We got to go online and we want to go on time. We're ready. Now, all summer long, many teachers across the country have been protesting schools reopening. Dr. Fauci understands there is a risk with that decision that children can get seriously ill. But he also says there are important reasons to reopen that benefit students. It's important for the children because of the psychological benefit and in some places, even for the nutrition of children who rely on the breakfast and the lunches in school for proper nutrition. Now, in a Facebook post, the United Employees, the United School Employees of Pasco County, they're actually going to be rallying this morning at 8:30 in front of school district headquarters. And Avery, we are told that the reason they're rallying, what they're really pushing for, is they are asking to do to start the school year with that online format and just start with e-learning right off the bat because they think that is the safest option. Back over to you. Yeah, there's a lot going into this decision too. I hope that they can get some kind of compromise together where everyone feels safe going back to school. Thanks, Megan.